just dies over and over and over. Um, not saying that's not my own fault. Yo, you think I don't see you up there? Below Sagdiev, thank you as well. Not the Eye of Sauron fight. That would be if we were playing, like, Lord of the Rings Return of the King for PlayStation 2, Xbox, GameCube era. All right, I got a question about those games that's been on my mind wow. for quite some time. Thank you, Cripples, for the subscription as well. Maybe you can answer the question for me. You, we all know the events of the Lord of the Rings. Well, also, Beller Life Talks. Thanks for the subscription. We all know the events of Lord of the Rings, uh, Fellowship of the Ring, The Two Towers, and Return of the King as it relates to the films. Whoa! Shock Trooper, it's not a good choice to get hit by. Um, why is it that the Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers on PlayStation 2 contains the events of the Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring movie? It doesn't make any goddamn sense to me. You know, wait, why am I fighting the Balrog in Lord of the Rings The Two Towers? It doesn't make any freaking sense. Why am I meeting Tom Bombadil? Wow. Little Pharma. That's a, that's a very self-aware name. I like it. Thank you very much for the subscription. Saren just became a, an LCD touchscreen. Or did he? No! Oh, that's the old classic... Uh, duck beneath the computer trick that's because there wasn't a fellowship of the ring game that is true make it in time shepherd had to wipe out a few hundred of your followers along the way sorry if i kept you waiting you've lost you know that don't you in a few minutes sovereign will have full control of all the citadel systems. well saren doesn't know that there's a sequel so i think i have a bit of an intellectual advantage here jt the chocolate sailor Thank you as well. I'm heading to that master control panel and you can't stop me. You survived wow. that encounter on and Rano. But I've changed. Thank you as well. Improved. Sovereign has upgraded. Me. I have opposable thumbs now. I can open doors. Fancy hardware is not going to save you. You don't understand, Shepard. There is a place for organics in the new order. The Reapers need men and women of action. People like us. Sovereign recognizes your value. You've impressed it. Surrender to the Reapers, and you will be spared. Join us, and we can find a place for you. Um, let's try to talk him out of it. I mean, we do have all those intimidating charm points, right? <laughs> My strength has increased 2,000% since our last meeting. Tyler and Sira Nykul. Thank you for the, the resubscription. And Brill Cosby. Sovereign's controlling you through your implants. Don't you see that? It would have been great if there was a dialogue option that was like, all right, dude. Let's do it. Me, you, and the Reapers. The strengths of both, the weaknesses of neither. I am a vision of the future, Shepard. The evolution of all organic life. This is our destiny. Join Sovereign and experience a true rebirth. I'd rather die than live like that. Then you will die. And your companions. Everyone you know and love. Everyone you've ever met. Don't you understand? You will all die. In the divide with the bull the and the bear. Stopped, not by the Protheans, not by you. The cycle always continues. I'm done arguing with you. Let's end this. Oh, heck yeah, they saved. The game saved. Yo, get behind cover. That's not cover. That's a, there's a grenade right next to you. Get behind cover. Okay, good start. People told me this would be good practice for uh, for me too, is to practice actually experiencing what cover is like. All right, this. I hate when you fight a boss, and you're like. Oh, I accidentally clicked off the screen there. Guaranteed, this is a, uh, a multi-stage boss. Yo, why is my mouse pointer now on the screen? Excuse me? This is extremely disorienting. I put the mouse pointer over here, it's pointing over there. Put the mouse pointer over here, it's pointing over here. This is not helpful in the least. NL, please. NL, please. Um, wow. Settings. Input. Sames? 
3x cheese. Thank you very much for the subscription as well. Thought maybe just by applying it, it might get rid of my mouse pointer. Yes, it did. This guy's used a computer before. All right. Stay, please, stop shooting me. Oh, there he is. What's he... Th crouch. That's a grenade. Yo, where's my sarin at? My gun overheated. I shot twice and so my gun overheated? Oh, it's because he hit me with a, you know, some kind of special power. So that's all right. Just give it a minute here. I mean... Saren's not really, you know, freaking me out that much right now. But what I was saying before the whole mouse pointer thing went down is that you know this has got to be a multi-stage boss based on the fact that his first phase is way too easy. Speaking of which, let's heal up. <laughs> Did just eat a rocket, like, right to the face. Joe Mount Mount, thank you for the subscription as well. Yo, this this game's rated T for teen? This is some violent stuff right here. I don't buy it. I don't buy it for a second. He's gonna come back with some freaking uh, Reaper technology. He's gonna be half robot, half Saren. It's gonna be Neo Saren, Neo Sporin. I've got control of all systems. Quick, open the station's arms. Maybe the fleet can take Sovereign down before he regains control of the station. See if you can open a communications channel. The Destiny Ascension. Main drives offline. Talia Tate, thanks for the reset as well. The council is on board. I repeat, the council is on board. Normandy to the Citadel. Normandy to the Citadel. Please tell me that's you, Commander. You were expecting of someone course. else. Of course. that distress call, Commander. I'm sitting here in the Endura sector with the entire Arcturus fleet. We can save the Ascension. Just unlock the relays around the Citadel and we'll send the cavalry in. Are you sure about this, Shepard? Human casualties will be very high if you send your fleet in now. This is bigger than humanity. Sovereign is a threat to every organic species in the galaxy. True. That's why you can't waste reinforcements trying to save the Council. You must hold them back until the Citadel arms open up and the human fleet can go after Sovereign. What's the order, Commander? Come in now to save the Ascension? Or hold back? I... I... Let's talk about this. I don't really understand my two options. One of the axes of this decision is saving the council or letting the council die. My focus right now seems to be concentrate on the sovereign. You know, crush the crush sovereign, stop the reapers, shouldn't be a problem. Is there a way we can let the council die and also concentrate on sovereign? We need the council to die so that other species may live. Something, something, something. Yeah, you know what? I should have hung up on you when I had the chance. Hold off, Joker. We're not sacrificing human lives to save the council. Keep our ships back until they can get a shot at Sovereign. A sacrifice for the greater good. Wow. I only pray it is not made in Jay vain. Clone, thanks for the subscription as well. All Alliance ships, home formation. Wait for a shot at Sovereign. Nothing else matters. I repeat. Nothing else matters. Was that really... Like, I'm not disappointed. I'm just surprised if that was actually the final boss fight against Saren. Because that was, like... Commander, we're picking up substantially the easier than I would have expected. This is the ascension. We're taking heavy damage. Joker, if there's ever been a time to take your snap back off, it's probably, Commander. you know, when the fate of the world hangs in the They've balance. First you used the door, then you became the door. Oh hell yeah, it's just like the end of Independence Day.
Make sure he's dead. Yeah, why aren't you just like riddling him with bullets? You, your pistol has unlimited ammo. Yeah, I knew it. Final boss doesn't go down that easy. Or or does it? Yo, use a couple hundred more. He's dead. I think he may not be dead, in hindsight. I mean, he doesn't look like he's having a great time right now, I think we have to admit that. Yo, Geth. Geth Saren looks pretty silly. I like it, but that is funny. I freaking overheats my gun in two seconds, you little dick. Yo, watch out for this guy. He's too close for comfort. That's all right. We got a unity cast. Get it out there. We got another singularity coming up soon. Barrier eventually. I didn't mean to snap on the cover there, but I guess in the whole scheme of things, it could have gone worse. Let's go to town. Good stuff. It's alright, we'll get a Unity cast in five or six years. Don't sweat it, Liara. Where is this guy shooting his rockets from? He's freaking sovereign. He doesn't give a shit about anything. Except, you know, being able to be autonomous and make his own decisions. It's alright, we got another Unity cast eventually. Barrier? Barrier would be nice to take us into Unity. Overheating. Unity's not super far away. Way to not use Rex at all. Hey, that's not fair. I used Rex on a couple missions. God, Liara is trashed here. Well, you know, one day she's going to be super smart. She's still basically like eight years old in her own age, right? This is our only chance. Take that monster down. In her species age, so she's almost, you know, not. She shouldn't be doing anything for us right now. Oh, hell yeah. Cast Unity. Get people up. Cast Barrier. Cast the Singularity. Thanks, Ray Kurzweil. Basically, just fucking unload all your biotics, apparently. I hope he doesn't have any antibiotics. Unlike this nation's beef supply, am I right? Who did he take to Bone Town last episode? Well, uh, if by Bone Town you mean sharing an unbelievably important spiritual connection, the likes of which mere mortals can't uh, fathom, um, then. Dr. Liara to Sony, of course. Yo, go Buck! Whoa! He's too close for comfort. One of these days, I'm gonna hit with the biotic. And then you'll all be fucking sorry. You'll all be sorry you doubted Commander Shepard of whatever my ship is called, the Normandy. 
The USS Brittany, something like that. If you ever overheat my weapon again, and try to steal my fucking sunshine, I'm gonna be very displeased. It's our moment! Oh, wait, he just dis dissolves into dust when you shoot him? I expected it to have some dialogue where I could be like, you know, requiescat in pace or something like that. Take the codex brain. <laughs> yeah, that that final boss was easier than like fighting a single Andromedon in XCOM 2. Dark Rug, thanks for the subscription as well. Don't let the door glitch you on the way out. I love it. Hell yeah. And we've saved the universe from evil aliens yet again. And the next game is just a high school dating slim, dating slim, dating sim slash visual novel. Did he quote Martin Sheen? Because that's a crazy coincidence if he did. Did I quote Martin Sheen? What did What did Martin Sheen say? You woman tweet me about Martin Sheen today. I know who Martin Sheen is. I don't. I don't know if I quoted him uh, accidentally or something. Martin Sheen has said a lot. Yeah, exactly. I can't be held responsible. He's lived like five times longer than I have. The system error. Thank you as well. Where's the commander? Don't let the door glitch you on the way out, Martin Sheen. Hell yeah! Sorry, am I late? Somebody left the stove on. Wow. Dirter Rar Dragon, thank you for the subscription. Oh. Requiescat and Pache was meant to be an Assassin's Creed reference, not Martin Sheen. You got your message, Ambassador. What's all this about? No need to get worked up, Captain. I'd like to end this meeting with all my teeth still in place. You should thank me for what I did. If the Normandy was still grounded, we'd all be dead right now. I understand, Captain. You did what you had to do. That's not why you're here. We need to talk about what happened. Clownface, thank you for the resub as well. Commander Shepard did the right thing. Why are they playing the sinister we music? Yo, we saved the universe. Don't let this guy get in our way. The only way. We're the only arbiter for justice in the galaxy right now. Presents us with an opportunity. The council is dead. The galaxy is looking for leadership. The citadel fleets were decimated in the attack. The losses have made the alliance stronger. If we step forward now, nobody will be able to stop us. Nah, dog. This is some George Washington shit. I'm not gonna kill the council just to become the council. You know, and like become the king. We should restore the council because I believe in the higher order ideals of democracy. Humanity has to find its rightful place in the stars, but we should get there on a merit-based uh, opportunity rather than, you know, strong-arming our way in. We should restore the council. Because I if I think if I do this, is this motherfucker going to become the ambassador or the council member or, you know, the consul of the universe? Because he's a piece of garbage. 
Keith, yeah, I want Keith David on the council. I could do that. You just killed the Space UN and now you want to be diplomatic? I know Down is always renegade. Okay, well, we'll follow it. Let's see. The council was always holding us back. When I saw the Don't be a paragon bitch, NL. Yo, if I can give Keith wow. David the council's power, I will. Don't act so surprised, Captain. Pause 3000, thanks true. for the subscription and two. Trying to switch up my subscription diatribe. The means. We I said two instead of as well. It's what makes us stronger than the others. What are you saying? The galaxy needs leadership, real leadership. When a crisis hits, we can't be paralyzed by debate like the old council. The new council must rule with a single voice. It must be assembled from one species alone, humanity. Five Nights at Funtown, thank you as well. Yo, this isn't right, man. This doesn't feel right. I want Keith David to be prime minister. I gotta say, this isn't right. I don't, I don't wanna be space Hitler here. Stand against the Reapers. The I want to be like Space Benicio scared. del Toro from Sicario. Anything like this before? They don't know what to do. They want us to step forward. They believe in humanity because of you. Your ruthless pursuit of Saren and the Geth. Your defiance of the Council. That's what humans are capable of. That's how we can defeat the Reapers. The others will follow us, Shepard. They know where their only hope. We will have a human council with a human chairman. Nah, this the ambassador's right. Nah, dog, the, the music. The Are you guys not hearing the background music? We gotta, we gotta back leader. out. The alliance will want to know who you think our chairman should be. It should be Captain Anderson. We're That's hundred percent. War. We need someone with military experience. Someone like Captain Anderson. You make a good case, Captain. Are you ready for this? I don't know if any of us are ready for this. But I'll do what I can. So what happens now? The Reapers are still out there. They're coming. And I'm gonna find some way to stop them. There's no way I'm making the leader Houdini. I want Captain Anderson to make him into Houdini. Make Shepard's him disappear. Right. That's not really We're what Houdini did. we with the Reapers. If we lose, it's the end of all life as we know it. And no other species in the galaxy truly understands what it will take to survive. The other races will have to follow our lead. We need to take control. It's time for humanity to rise up and seize its destiny. Whoa, what the heck? Is this her posing for like a magazine cover? Look at him making an impassioned speech to one person. Wow, <laughs> it's not false. Dubious salmon. Thank you as well. This is like some Rocky IV music right here. It's totally some Rocky IV music. Here I got my head. Gonna punch Apollo Creed in the head. Highway Leopard. 